When you see a multiplication fraction problem, you can actually save yourself a lot of work in reducing the answer by reducing the problem itself. This is a little x, and so you look along the lines of the x to see if you can reduce by dividing by the greatest common factor uh, on the diagonal numbers. So 12 and 8, you look at those and you say, hmm, can I divide those by the same number? Yes, I can. They're both divisible by 4. 12 divided by 4 is 3. 8 div divided by 4 is 2. So I cross these out and write what it's equal to by dividing both of those by the same number. 21 and 3 can both be divided by 3. That's equal to 7. That's equal to 1 when I divide by 3. Now I multiply the new numbers that I have. 3 times 1 is 3, and 7 times 2 is 14, and there's my answer. Much easier than doing it multiplying 12 times 3 and 21 times 8 and then reducing that.